It's no secret that reality TV often blurs the lines between real life and scripted performance. In a recent candid discussion, Zach Roloff, one of the stars of Lil People, Big World, opened up about his honest feelings on filming the show that has chronicled his family's life for decades. Zach revealed that despite his long tenure on the show, he had reached a breaking point. Yeah, there's episodes I regret, and there's things I've said that I regret. I think overall would I do it again and not do the show obviously now that I know as an adult I would do it again, but there are definitely parts that I wish I would change. These words highlight a complex relationship with a life lived under constant observation. The entire Roloff family has been significantly impacted by their time on the show. While most of his siblings have moved on to other pursuits, their youngest brother Jacob notably left in 2016 after he turned 18. Jacob's decision was influenced by his desire for personal growth and family focus, as well as unsettling experiences like being groomed by a former producer. Jacob later addressed this in a deeply personal Instagram post, it is often much easier to think about things than it is to talk about them. And so this disclosure has been delayed, but through that delay, I have found the fortitude and words. A significant factor in Zach's dissatisfaction stemmed from his father's unexpected decision to put a portion of their family farm up for sale without consulting him. This betrayal sparked a public feud between Zach and Matt Roloff. Matt put a portion of the farm, including their original family home, up for sale without consulting his children. This move deeply hurt Zach. The tensions were further compounded by occupational disagreements during critical farming seasons. Zach's wife, Tori Roloff, has remained steadfast in supporting her husband. They were not formally asked to return for season 26 after an especially tumultuous cycle. However, despite all the drama surrounding the family farm and reality TV life, Tori's commitment to their family's well-being remains evident. In reflecting on their journey both on and off screen, it's clear that the Roloff's experiences provide an insightful look into the complexities of reality television and its impacts on personal lives. Little People, Big World stars Zach and Tori Roloff didn't mince words when discussing society's attitude toward children with dwarfism. During Zach and Tori's July 4 episode of their Raising Heights podcast, the parents of three opened up about negative comments they feel from strangers. We get a lot of feedback from people that just don't deserve to have a voice, honestly, like in our lives, Tori explained. It is brought up occasionally, you know, questioning our decision to have children when we knew they could have dwarfism. Zach, 34, noted that he and Tori, 33, had a 50 50 chance of having a dwarf child during each pregnancy. However, all three of their kids Jackson, 7, Lilla, 4, and Josiah, 2 were born with a chondroplasia dwarfism. We have three children that have dwarfism that we chose to bring into this world, Tori shared, and I can't imagine in what world you live in that you can look at our three kids and be like, yeah, that wasn't supposed to happen. She continued, I cannot look at my kids and see anything but the grace of God and the love of Jesus. Zach expanded on these sentiments, sharing, and then comments will say, like, why would you bring kids with dwarfism in? They're gonna get ridiculed. And it's like, hold on. That's not my problem and that's not their problem. That's those people's problems. At this point, the future of little people, big world, is unclear after Zach and Tori revealed in February they will not return for season 26 of the TLC series. The couple has three children, Jackson, Lilla, and Josiah, that were born with a chondroplasia, the most common form of short-limbed dwarfism. Tori and Zach Roloff are getting candid about their decision to have kids, despite the chance that their children could have dwarfism. The couple whose three children Jackson, Lilla, and Josiah were born with a chondroplasia, the most common form of short-limbed dwarfism tackled the question on the latest episode of their Raising Heights podcast. It's very loud, and it's very hard to ignore when people question our decision to have children when we knew that they could have dwarfism, Tori shared on the podcast, and we knew pretty strongly that the children could have it. However, the couple said they decided to take the chance because the odds of their children being born with dwarfism was 50-50. The little people, Big World Star believed they just hit a dwarfism cluster somewhere in the cycle, he said. And if we have three more kids, they could all be average height, Satch added, while also noting that the couple already made the decision to stop having kids. Tori chimed in, we have ended it, we'll never know. Tori also explained in the podcast that the chances of their children having the same kind of dwarfism as Satch's dad Matt Roloff, diastrophic dysplasia, was the same as any average couple's chances since it was a recessive gene. The pair also discussed what people have said about them passing along the dwarfism genes to another generation. 
Tori described that mindset as sticky and very dangerous because they had no say on what genes were passed on and it was all a matter of fate. People are often looking for this perfect child and want to make sure that their kid doesn't have X, I, and problems, but that at the end of the day, it's in God's hands, they said. The couple, who wed in July 2015, welcomed son Jackson in 2017, daughter Leela in 2019, and their third child Josiah in 2022. Over the past few years, the pair have been candid about their life and raising their three children both on and off screen. During a 2021 Instagram story QA, Tori, who does not have a chondroplasia, responded to a question asking if she wished she could raise a child who doesn't have dwarfism. Absolutely not, Tori wrote. I'm obsessed with the three kids God gave me and I'd have it no other way. Lil People Big World viewers were not big fans of Audrey and Jeremy, but they have been impressed with the couple's bonding and understanding over the years. The LPBO stars have been living a drama-free life away from the cameras at their Oregon property. Jeremy and Audrey often receive criticism for their weird parenting style. However, the pair doesn't pay any heed to the haters. The reality TV stars have now been enjoying their newborn phase after the birth of their fourth baby. Previously, a lot of fans speculated a trouble in paradise for the couple. They have been speculating that the pair was not actually happy with each other. Fortunately, Jeremy and Audrey proved everyone wrong with their lovely updates. Now, it seems that Audrey is finally opening up about herself getting replaced with another girl. LPBO stars Audrey and Jeremy's lives have changed a lot since the arrival of their newborn. They have been sharing several glimpses of their wholesome life with fans. Little People Big World viewers have been following their new journey through their social media updates. But Audrey's latest confession left many fans shocked about the reality of her married life. Recently, she took to Instagram to record her husband while going on their date night. Surprisingly, Jeremy decided to hold their newborn, Mirabella, on their first date since having their fourth child. She recorded her husband as they were walking on the road. The reality TV star wrote, When you're on your first date since having a baby and he insists on holding his little girl instead of pushing her in the stroller back to the car. Audrey couldn't stop gushing over her husband over his newborn face despite having their fourth child. She continued, And it's our fourth baby, but watching him in the newborn phase never gets old. Several fans gushed over the wholesome new life of Audrey and Jeremy in the comment section. One fan stated, He says you carried her for nine months, it's my turn. Meanwhile, others called the TLC star lucky for having a sweet and loving husband. Moreover, a different fan added, Don't blame him. They only stay tiny for a little while. Further, the others gushed over Jeremy for giving daddy goals. LPB Dove stars Audrey and Jeremy might not be the most fan favorite celebrities, but they have been making fans crazy with their wholesome content on social media lately. Recently, Audrey shared another cute video with her husband as they were strolling casually on their property. Audrey wrapped her newborn around her using a cloth while Jeremy was happily walking with her. She noted, My walking around our property with big plans knowing full 